Actor Alec Baldwin spoke for the first time publicly today since firing a weapon that killed a cinematographer on a movie set in New Mexico last week. Baldwin and his wife pulled to the side of the road in Vermont and agreed to answer reporters' questions. He said he could not comment on the investigation, and at times there were some tense moments during this impromptu talk. Can't. Okay. It's an active investigation in terms of a woman dying. She was my friend. She was my friend. The day I arrived in Santa Fe to start shooting, I took her to dinner with Joel, the director. We were a very, very, excuse me, we were a very, very, you know, well-oiled crew shooting a film together, and then this horrible event happened. Alina Hutchins, I met with her husband, Matthew, and her son. Yeah, that's right. And uh, how did that meeting go? Uh, I wouldn't know how to characterize that. Okay. Be, they're they're, they're you, mortified. You guys, you, guys you know what? Do, no details. But do, do me a favor. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to answer the question. Well, I appreciate that he was probably very upset. The, the, the guy is overwhelmed with grief. This is something that, that you know, there are incidental accidents uh, uh, on film sets uh, from time to time, but nothing like this. This is a one in a trillion episode. It's a one in a trillion event. And so the, he is in shock. He has a nine-year-old son. You know, we are, you know, in constant contact with him because we're very worried about his family and his, his kid. And, uh, as I said, we're, we're, we're eagerly awaiting for the Sheriff's Department to tell us what their investigation has yielded. The shooting killed 42-year-old director of photography Helena Hutchins. The director of the movie, Joel Souza, was injured. Investigators say it is still too early to determine whether any charges will be filed.